After a year of the successful rollout of the corona vaccine, Europe is once again going under lockdown. The Netherlands beat its old case record by 3,000. Germany has 50,000 new cases a day. Austria's cases are up 40% on just a week ago. This is happening despite the wonderfully successful rollout of domestic vaccine passports in all three countries. The unvaccinated in Austria are about to be put under lockdown. The first time that has happened anywhere. The Austrian Chancellor said it was time for the unjabbed to suffer by being forced to stay indoors and only let out for essential reasons like buying food. In Germany, the unvaccinated will be banned from attending Christmas markets in Berlin with the option to provide a negative test removed. The fully vaccinated, who can still spread the virus, are welcome to attend. In Hamburg, the unvaccinated will be segregated from the double doses meaning they can't enter the area that sells food and drink. In Freigerich, a choir concert that only allowed the fully vaccinated to attend, ended with a COVID outbreak that infected at least 24 people. Germany is about to introduce 2G rules everywhere that eliminate the option of providing a negative test, meaning those who can absolutely prove they don't have COVID will be banned from numerous venues. Meanwhile, guess which country in Europe isn't going back under lockdown. You guessed it, it's Sweden. The country that didn't introduce domestic vaccine passports, mask mandates, or legal lockdowns. Here's a graph showing Sweden's COVID caseload compared to the rest of Europe's average. Gee, I wonder who got it right. To get exclusive content, early access, behind the scenes stuff, and to personally interact with me, please sign up for my community at pauljosephwatson.locals.com. Link in description, and thank you for your generous support.